I'd like to show you how you can buy um, affordable art work from my website. And um, this is my gallery space on fineartamerica.com. They are a print on demand website. They've been around since 2006 and they allow artists like me to upload my images and they handle all of the processing and deliveries and customer service, payments, the whole lot. So um, I can carry on with creating new work and it makes life easy for you as the buyer also. So just to show you how it works, when you go on the website, you have a search area here. So you can search by artist, for example, or keyword. But if you put in my name there and click on the search uh, button there, you will come to this section here. Now you have two ways that you can search for um, gift ideas. So one is all the different formats that my art prints can be presented in. So you have lots of different um, options when it comes to prints. They can be framed or they can be on a stretched canvas or you can even get them on wood or metal. And you can get them on iPhones and there's actually a wider range just here when you click that button there. So you can see, for example, there are face masks, you can get tote bags, jigsaw puzzles, lots of things. I'm going to just skip this part for the moment and go down to this area here. So all of my art images that are uploaded to uh, Fine Art America can be displayed here in this section. So if you just choose one that appeals to you. So let's pick one of these images here. So this is a little winter robin um, print. So if you click on him, um, you'll see here on the right hand side, you still have all the choices of categories of products. Okay, so for example, if you want to buy a lifestyle product, you will pick one of these. So maybe like a, a lovely carry bag, tote bag, maybe you pick that there. Or if you want a phone case cover, um, coffee mug, okay, face mask. Okay, so there's lots of options here, and all of the wall art, uh, different types of uh, prints, they're here also. For in this example, I'm going to select stationery and greeting card because this is actually quite nice. You have um, a choice of quantity, a single card, or if you want better value, I would select um, either 10, pack of 10 or pack of 25. Okay, so it shows you the price for a pack of 25 cards, it's 169 per card, which is quite good value. Again, you have a choice here for the orientation, but if you do that, if you change the orientation, it will crop the picture. And this is the original way that I painted this um, particular picture. So I would suggest you use it like this. And if you come down here, there's another nice feature. You can actually put in your own greeting, personalized greeting in the card itself. So I'm going to type something here. Stevens. Stephen's greetings, and here it shows you how it would look centered on the inside of the card. And if you would like to see a three dimensional image of that, here we are. So there's the inside, your greetings are in there. And the back of the card will have the um, Fine Art America's brand down there, and my name will be here with the name of the title of the painting. Okay, so that's quite a nice feature there to test that out. Now we're happy enough with this, so the next step is add to cart, just like on any other shopping website. Now I already had some items in the cart, I'm going to delete them for the moment. Delete and delete. Okay, so we just have this um, winter robin here. And if you go to checkout, you can see that it ships from the UK. And because I'm in Ireland, this is the shipping fee here, 15 euros, 85, and the total here. So you have an option, you can pay by PayPal or credit card, whichever you prefer, and all your contact information then is required, just the same as any other um, shopping website that you would visit, okay? And then continue to complete your order. Now, we're going to go back, okay? We're going to continue shopping so that I can give you another example. So the quickest way, simplest way I find is click on the cart symbol 
and go down here on the left to continue shopping. Okay, that brings you back to the area where all my artwork is. And if you can't find your way back, you just simply type my name there and search. Okay, so now we've gone back there. Um, let's this time, let's choose um, let's choose a print. Okay, now you have two choices. You can choose from the category of print here, like it says there, print. Okay, or you can come down and pick out the actual image that you want. And in this case, I'm going to pick Rathfilly after the rain, which is a little Irish village in County Carlow, where I grew up. Okay, so um, this painting was originally painted in oil, um, and now you can find lots of different ways to purchase a copy of it. So wall art is the category that you want to select a print, and you can get a canvas print, for example, like that, three-dimensional stretched on a frame, or you can purchase the image and, and select your own frame, like for example here, lots of different types of frames, okay? Or in this case, what I'm going to do, um, I'm just going to pick simple art print, okay? Because if you're buying this for yourself or for a friend, you might like to choose your own um, frame at the end of the day for, you know, for whatever suits your home. Um, so that's, I'm just going to show you this. So you have a choice of sizes, so maybe pick any one you want, whichever suits. And I'm going to leave the shape natural because that's the original, how the painting looked. Um, I'm leaving the frame at none for this stage. Matte, I don't generally change that either. Um, I've never sampled those particular choices, so I can't actually, um, I can't advise you on that part, that part. But on the paper, I would suggest, if you're picking any of my art prints, I would suggest you pick Somerset Velvet, okay? That's uh, got a nice texture, uh, which lends itself to our art images that, that would have been oil paintings or um, acrylic paintings. This was originally an oil painting, okay? So once you're happy with that, um, let's see, the next step is add to cart, okay? So add to cart, and it's asking me for um, email and begin checkout, but I just want to bring you back this way, okay? So go back up here to the cart. And you'll see there it's already added in and there's our Robin greeting cards which we did there just a few moments ago and the art print. Now we're going to go to the checkout to show what happens here. You may notice there that both of these items are shipping from the UK. Now I live in Ireland so the nearest place for these things to be processed is, is actually in the UK. Um, if I lived in the USA, they would ship from the USA. Um, there are some products that are only uh, processed in the UK, such as textile items, fabric related items, look, uh, such as the tote bags and, for example, the face masks. Those items currently are all processed in the USA. So if you live in Europe, you will probably find that there is an extra shipping charge associated with, with those. Um, but these two items both ship from the UK, so there's just one shipping charge, okay? So we're going to go back again. I just want to pick another item just to show you that example. So I go back to the cart and down here to continue shopping. Now, this time I'm going to select um, a different product, okay? Um, I'm going to actually select it from the product area. So I'm going to show you the face masks this time. Some face masks. All right, so here are the selection of face masks that show my colorful artwork. I'm going to pick this one here, the in between. So you have a choice again. You can have um, non pleated or pleated. Okay, so this is the pleated one. And again, it says here one size fits all, but there are some extra information here that you, you should just take a note of as well. Okay. These are for a general purpose, you know, when you're out and about in the community. So just read the information. Um, it's not a surgical mask, okay? 
Um, okay, so again, add to cart. Okay, and then we go to cart. There it is, added all there. And I'm going to check out. And now you see that the total is there. We've got our three items. And just like I was explaining before, the mask is a fabric textile item. So it ships from the USA. And because of that, you have an extra shipping, um, different shipping fee attached to that. So that's added in there. And that's your total. And so you just fill out your details like you normally would in any other online shipping process and continue to your payments. So I'm just going to go back here again to the cart to continue shopping. And you know, just you see there it's the keyword. I'm going to delete that keyword. It brings me back to the start. Okay. So there are quite a lot of ways that you can shop on Fine Art America. Um, as I said, there is the list of products, okay, and there's the, all the images. So we can either choose an image and then choose the product, or choose the product and whichever image uh, you prefer from that. Um, not all of my artwork is presented in all of the different product ranges because they don't all suit um, these different formats. So these are the ones that I have selected to be presented as a jigsaw puzzle. And let's just go into one of these for a moment. This is Varanasi Cow. It's from my Indian Heartway collection. And in the jigsaw puzzle um, option, you can choose a 500 piece jigsaw or a 1,000 piece jigsaw. Okay, so there's a 1,000 piece jigsaw there. Again, I would recommend leaving the orientation as it is there because otherwise it will be cropped and uh, this is the original format of the painting. So just I'm going to click here on to show you what it looks like as a jigsaw. There's some pieces there. Um, okay, there's the box that it would come in. And that's back to the start. Okay, so you have your viewing options there. Um, okay, again, it has the little description here and some care instruction. And here it says ships within one to two business days. Okay, so that's how many days it takes for this to be processed and ready for shipping. Okay, and uh, let's just add it to the cart. Go to the cart. There it is there. Let's go to the checkout. And this one ships from the US. Okay, this is a relatively new product that Fine Art America have created as an option. So there is our total. And again, you go to the checkout. Okay. Um, I'm hoping that this has been a useful tutorial for you. But if you still have any more questions, um, please do get in, in contact. My website is carolinecunningham.com. My email is info, info at carolinecunningham.com. And if you have any questions relating to um, returns and things like that, all of the information is presented here at the bottom of Fine Art America's website. So you can find out, for example, um, there's a frequently asked question section, a contact us section, a returns policy, terms of use, all of that is there. So I would suggest checking those out if you have any questions. But if, if they're not answered for you there, do get in touch. Okay. Um, let's see, back to the homepage. That's it. Thanks for joining in. See you soon.